So Clayton apparently works at Honda now. Oh, already messing up on day one. I thought I was tall enough. Anyways, um, he's basically gonna rebuild his whole front suspension because he's gonna get new tires, or he has new tires. He has brakes, he has ball joints and all this stuff. And cupcakes as well. Daddy. Anyways. <laughs> Um, he bought some new Toyos. These are the same ones I got on my Corolla. They're actually really good on the highway. So um, I told him, I'll tell him about the... I can't speak today. I told him to buy them. I'm going to be switching those out right now on the RPF ones and doing all the brakes. But he's... Um, I'm actually going to remove the axle for him over here so that he can go get it switched out at O'Reilly's. And we also saw that his sway bar end links are ripped, his boots. You can see it's ripped right there. So, can I go send him off to go do that while I do the tires over here? Dude, I don't know, man. What is that color, dude? Is it hot? No, it's warm. Maybe that's why, but. Dude. Well, I think when it gets warmer and the viscosity. That's the ugly ass color, dude. Go get some new Synchro Mesh. I know. That's what I'm gonna yeah, do. It's ripped, dude. Look. See? Oh. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, see. this looks like an AutoZone on Riley's axle. Yeah, it does. How does the um, motor mounts look? You, you, better, you better make sure they have one, actually. Ask for a Celica one if they yeah. don't. these tires are directional I got my two rights already gonna get my two lefts so we're gonna look at the sidewall and see where it says left left so now we got our lube let's get the the rim of the tire make sure you do it on both sides doesn't have to be perfect we can clean the tires up later this down, bring this up, and just hold it, set, set that down, that's going to help us, so if I do this with one hand, Stem and just put it in there. So now we go to the tire balancer. Make sure it's tight. And then we remove any old weights that we see. There's none on the outer lip, but there's one on the inner lip. So I'm gonna get this and just them off 
It's already set for our measurements. gram on the outer lip so right here we're gonna put 20 these each of these are five so we get two of those four of those but we gotta clean it up first so that's 35 which is what it's asking for oh there it goes Just finished all four of the wheels and Clayton's tackling the axle seals that are leaking right there. Here you replace that side axle seal. I'm gonna do the brakes on this side so that we could tag team and get this done with. They got about two hours left. What you doing right here? You're doing the ball joint. He's gonna replace the ball joint. The one on the driver's side for sure is torn up. But I'm just gonna tackle on brakes. You guys have seen me do brakes on the channel before, so don't even make this a tutorial video, but I'm gonna change out to some fresh looking rotors. Got both ball joints removed. They're already starting to leak, so these are bad. It's awesome. I'm gonna focus on the front brakes now. Actually, we should probably put the ball joint first. So we got front brakes and rear brakes done. Nothing really new to, to the channel. You guys already know how to do all that. I'm not gonna go over it again. I, mean, I have made multiple videos on how to do brakes. So there you have it. Also did the rears. Team coilovers. If you guys are wondering what's he lowered on and this axle was actually bad. You can see right here, it's spitting all the grease out. And we already replaced the axle seals. I already took out his, both his control arms. And he has some over here with energy suspension ones. These are probably gonna not be all that daily drivable-ish, but whatever, it's his car. Um, I sent Clayton to go get the axle, as I said, and in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and just clean up whatever I can. And I'm gonna go ahead and clean up the bolts so they go in a lot smoother. So let me go ahead and do that right now. Clay's back. <laughs> Anyways, um, we already went ahead and installed the axle. Axle's installed, uh, ball joints. This is a new ball joint. We already went and installed the energy suspension, I think that's what they're called. Yeah, are they called energy suspension? Energy suspension, is that what they are? I don't know. I well, anyways, actually, yeah, the are energy suspension, yep. So we already did both sides, and I've never heard of this, but this man was so cheap. <laughs> he literally went to the junkyard and grabbed secondhand sway bar and links. Because he was trying to order some from Rock Auto, but they weren't going to get here in time. And so, I mean, these are better than the ones he had. Both sides, both of them were torn apart. Yeah, pretty much. Um, new axle was installed, so it's not going to be squirting any more grease. Sway bar and links are tight. And I went ahead and removed his wheels because I'm going to bleed his brakes with the machine that we have here. This is one reason why I hate the Curl and Matrix. I hate that shit. Not the sway bar, the solid rear end. Trash. One more. So, it is a little off. I'm trying to line it. See the cam. I don't know why the camber's showing this time that it's good. Toe is slightly off. So the rear doesn't have any adjustment. We're gonna adjust the front. And in order to adjust the front, we're right here on our 
tie rod end we're gonna loosen this big nut right this big nut right here uh, see so we loosen this nut sorry if i'm not getting the single so we're gonna loosen this nut right here and then we're gonna focus on here let me see if i could do this save before measurements ready So I'm gonna get this to zero, or not zero, just the, to the green. Can you get this area? Well, it's right here. We're gonna loosen this one. This one right here. Oh my god, I'm not gonna be able to at this angle. Tie rod in. Can you come from this side? Oh, there it goes. So we loosen this right here, and then we're gonna adjust it right here. So go look at the screen now. Go look at the screen. We're gonna. We're gonna look at this one right here. We're gonna look at our toe. Very off. All I'm doing right now is just. Point zero one percent. There we go. Perfect. All right. Oh, come on, man. See that, dude? So, clans over here gonna remove the. Actually, you probably should have done that one first, dude. <laughs> and I'll hold it up. I already removed, replaced that one. Ooh. Yeah, these hood struts are, or these hat struts are a little tricky to do. It's just like a little band, right? Yeah, just pull. It's just basically pulling it out. But cars aligned. He's a hoarder, low key. And he's over here struggling with this. How's it working there, buddy? Uh, bruh. That's all I got. Having a bruh moment. Oh. You're gonna stab yourself with Dude, that. Dude, I've shit. done that like three times. <laughs> Get I'm that looking. hand away! Oh my god, I can't stand and watch. All right, cool. Just eat it. No, keep eating it out. Pull. There you go. All right. So yeah, do that. Please do it away from your fingers. Ay, ay, ay. He's gonna stab himself. Play in his most focused environment. <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> you want to get a closer for you? No, no, no. Tits. So, today is done. Clay and wanted to take a quick pick. Both XRSs. Let me probably get out of his view. Uh, I'm going to go have dinner right now. Still at work. That's bright. Of what do you? Of course, we're posted up here, bro. What are you eating? Only the best. Shout out to my boy Evan. <coughs> Cringe. A number nine from Popeyes. That's right. Oh my god. Cringe, Lord. Yeah, two XRSs at Popeyes. When you're that guy that wants to take Popeyes pictures. <laughs> 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 